Hey guys, welcome back. It's Claytano. Thank you so much for tuning in as always. And today I'm going to be showing you the absolute safest free to play Giants B10 team out there. Okay. And so make sure you guys have a pen and paper handy because you're going to want to take a lot of notes in this video because there's going to be a lot of informational shit that you want to be able to remember and reference later for sure. So let's just go over the runes here real quick. I'm not going to go super in depth with it, but we, first off we have the Veligil, very free to play, easy obtainable nat five. You can get them from almost any secret dungeon that has Veligils there and it is violent will pretty speedy enough said moving on to Ariel, another free to play nat five for the most part you can get him super easily as well not even that great of runes nemesis 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 we have eladriel with the violent indoor set again very free to play and then these next two you can almost just farm these in your sleep super free to play that i think there was hohs for both of them first off we have the artamiel with the despair will build very nice very nice nice crit rate nice crit damage there and then we have fermion here as well with a vampire guard set and again fermion super free to play you guys can get him almost at any point in the game just say I want Fermion and he will show up in your box also maybe hit subscribe and he'll show up in your box as well who knows you know you might as well just try it but let's go ahead and see GB10 and I I, I feel like this is gonna change your guys' lives because it's super free to play super easy let's go all right so we got into the game again shout out to Airy for letting us use his Fermion. It's the only monster that I don't have out of these five monsters because I have yet to farm my Fermion HOH, unfortunately. But here we go. We got the Artamiel just, you know, just revenging everything. We have a lot of just stuns going down and provokes from the Fermion. Veladual, Veladual missed his dot so you know it's gonna make the run a little bit slower but this is a really really fast run as well look at him you can see him just pile driving him down just whack a moling whack a moling <laughs> another one but you know we got Veligual putting those condoms up and they, they, they don't have they don't have the you know the, the the needle they don't have the right needle to remove our condoms that Veligual is just sliding over all of our monsters <laughs> he's just sliding all those condoms all over our monsters and uh, they just don't have the ability to poke holes in them. They, they don't, maybe they got too much morals. They have too many morals that they feel like, oh, you know what? You're putting a condom on. I don't want to, you know, mess with anything. I'm, I'm not into that. I'm not into that. They, they don't have any strippers. They don't have any strippers. They don't have any strippers to make our condoms fall off. So, I mean, it, is, it just is what it is. But here we go. So we're now on the uh, little mini boss. I'm going to hit the middle one just to you know, make this go a whole lot faster, hopefully. And okay, so we're out without condoms. And then, oh no, Veligil got provoked. What's going to happen? Oh, oh, he got stunned too. Oh no, we might, we might actually get them impregnated because we don't have condoms up. And we're just pile driving. We're pile driving the mini boss without condoms. Oh no, <laughs> we just keep getting stunned. Oh, there we go, there we go. He was like, wait, 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 pull out, pull out. All right, put him on. Okay, okay, we're good. <laughs> we're good to go now, all right. And so just, again, just pile driving that little mini boss there. We got the Provoke on, so now he's not gonna go after Veligul. He's gonna go after the Fermion. And we're just, uh, just whack, whack, whack. I, I feel like that's the only thing we do is just whack him. Just whack him. And again, and again, and again. And, ag and again, <laughs> it just just doesn't stop. There's nothing else we can do. We got a nice little dot on there though, so that way it can help take out that HP just a slight bit faster, but not even, not even one dot fell off. So what are you gonna do? <laughs> I mean, really, what are you gonna do? All right, so the crystal is down. Nice damage from that Fermion there to take out that crystal. Again, nice damage from that Veligual as well to take out that other crystal there. And then now we got these last three golems to work on. And then it's on to the boss. And I don't know, guys. We might... No, I'm just kidding. This is a very, very safe team. Very safe team. Again, if you guys have not gotten these monsters already, you got you got to make sure that you don't miss the HOH. They do HOHs for all of these monsters all the time. You gotta make sure that you're getting in there. Don't. There's no excuses now. There's no excuses. 
Oh, uh, and you're stunning the Veladrill. What is the resistance on him? There is no resistance. There you go, Artemal. Get in there. Take off that attack boost. I think we're in good shape. Just gonna keep on whacking and mulling, whacking and mulling, sticking our swords in them. We almost got completely wiped there. Crazy. I didn't think that was gonna happen, but we almost got completely wiped out. All right, remove that attack buff. And we're right back to full health. We got that dot on there. We got another dot on there. This is gonna go so much quicker, guys. I'm telling you, this is the fastest GB10 team you've ever seen. You've ever seen. Uh, because it, 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 once you put that condom on, you know, sometimes they have that extra pleasure in there. You know what I mean? But uh, yeah, let's let's hope. We, nope, didn't we miss the dot? We missed the dot. Come on, come on, Artemio. All right, there's a third dot, and we should be about two turns away. Maybe just one turn, one turn from the giant, and then he's gonna kill himself to the dots. Oh, Eladriel helping out his friend Ariel there with a nice heal. And we drop some more dots on there. Oh, we got one more dot left. And Artemil with a finishing blow. Congratulations, Artemil. You get the cookie this time. Four minutes and 39 seconds. Super, super quick. That's almost four minutes and 10 seconds. Just almost a little bit slower than my fastest time you've ever seen. And let's, let's go ahead and open this scroll here. See the awesomeness that we have received. And... Nice, we got some summoning stones. Now we can summon one eighth or something of a three star fodder monster. Super worth it. I'm, I am, I, I, this is the best strat. This is the OP strats of Summoner's War that you guys need to learn. And I'm telling you, the quicker you learn this, the faster you'll be able to progress into, into your uh, Summoner's War career. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't take it seriously. It's not serious at all. It's just for fun. It's just for fun. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed it, hit the like. Also, subscribe if you don't already. And as always, stay soupy. Don't be potatoes. For real this time, don't be potatoes. It's just for fun, guys. Relax. Don't be potatoes. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to drop a potato on your comment if you're a potato. All right. Stay soupy. See you next time. Bye-bye. What's going on, Soup? It's Claytano. Be sure to subscribe for more content every single day. If you missed yesterday's video, you can check it out here. And if you're in need of some free crystals, you can click on this other link instead. Also, if you want to stay connected with me personally, go ahead and hit me up on any social media platform at Claytano, and I will see you guys tomorrow.